is happening guys Jonathan here aka crazy shadow 303 here with another match vlog on crazy shadow talks football today it's West Bromwich Albion versus Reading the return of Andy Carroll to the Hawthorns um, as to be said and yeah I mean this is looking like it's going to be a really tight affair um, Reading are only a point ahead of us uh, in 10th we're in 11th uh, on 35 points after a resurging run of form um, it has to be said obviously the uh, the win against uh, Preston the other day um, greatly helped that uh, but as I said Reading you know they've um, they've had a bit of a mixed bag you know uh, they uh, they've won 11 they've lost 11 uh, so yeah I mean like I said they're only a point ahead of us they're only a point ahead of us. And, um, yeah, basically, you can hear the fans uh, behind me. Uh, <laughs> but, yeah, I mean, it's looking like it's going to be a really tight affair. Predictions will come later in the video. And, yeah, uh, shout out as well to Johnny Pavey and Laura Hall, um, who I hear is having a baby. So, future Albion fan, uh, hopefully. <laughs> So, shout out to you guys, congratulations, um, and yeah, hope all goes well, and yeah, I mean, West Bromwich Albion versus Reading, it's looking like it's going to be a really tight affair in my opinion, so yeah, come on Albion, boing boing. All right, guys, prediction time. Uh, Darren, what are you thinking today? I'm thinking a close to one win for the Albion. Yeah, yeah. As I've said in the intro, it is looking like it's going to be a tight affair. They've only got one more point than us. Uh, they've won 11, lost 11, as I said. Um, they've also got Andy Carroll. And, you know, any ideas on goal scorers? I know who I'm going to choose for Reading. Andy Carroll. Andy Carroll, Andy Carroll yeah, yeah. It'll be typical Albion look that Andy Carroll would score against us. Uh, goal scorers for the Albion, though? If he plays today and played like how he did on Thursday, Yakuslu. Yakuslu. Again, another two for Yakuslu. Yeah. Fair play. Uh, I'm predicting 2 1 as well. Um, as I said, typical Albion look, Andy Carroll to score against us. But I'm actually going to say Thomas Asante and uh, Davo DK. I'm actually going to say that. Uh, so, yeah, but either way, hoping it's a win for the Albion, another win. By the end of today, if all goes well, we could be in the playoff spots. So, here's hoping, guys. Uh, but, but, yeah. But so Red, Reading is, used to be our bogey team. Yeah, yeah, Reading, um, we, we do have a few problems, you know, beating Reading, but, you know... But look at the 2 0 win that West Brom had at the Majeski. At the Majeski, yeah. So earlier in the season, we but, won 2 0. But it's not called the Majeski anymore. It's called the No, it's the uh, car Select Car Leasing, Leasing Stadium. Yeah, yeah. Sponsors, eh? Uh, <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. So Davin's predicting 2 1. Same as me, 2 1. And yeah, come on, Albion. Boing boing. Right, once again, joined by Connor and Liam from West Brom Fan TV. I'll leave a link in the description below. Um, guys, what are your thoughts about today? West Brom. Um, I think nice. Reading's going to be a tough test. I think they're like one place above us. We can win today if we if we win by two goals or more. We actually go into the playoffs above Sunderland, I believe. Yeah. Don't quote me on it if I'm wrong. I believe that's what can happen. So confident. Looking forward to the protest later. To see what um, see what happens. Yeah. Um, but yeah. I'm confident. I think Andy Carroll's going to score. I think Jed Wallace will score. I think details. <laughs> not sure on the other one. I can't remember what I said, but I'm going to stick what I said in my vlog. 3-1 Albion. 3-1 Albion. Liam? Yeah, I'm going to go saying 3-1 Albion. Um, like Connor said, it's going to be a tough test today. I've got Andy Carroll to score for Reading. 
Um, but yeah, I think we're going to turn up today. I think it's going to make a performance. Must be a tough test, but I think we'll get out, get the job done. Three, one, twelve. Yeah, yeah. I think we've all got Andy Carroll to score for Reading today. Um, that's literally been the consensus for everyone. Um, do you think that we could have kept him if we made more of an effort? To be honest, you know when DK was out, he yeah. was crying out for someone who could head the ball. Yeah. Um, I think he would have done well. I think you know towards the end of last season, he was probably one of our best players. Do you? Yeah, yeah, he was. Yeah. He, he was a good player, but obviously, Workhorse. I don't think he got on with. Uh, I don't think he was very fond of Steve Bruce. He's come out and said stuff about Alvin and he'll, like, remember that um, easy three points when we played him at their ground? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Stuff like that. So uh, I don't think he was very keen on Steve Bruce. I don't know if it would have worked out. But... No, that, that's probably like rolled down from Newcastle yeah. as well. Yeah. You know, when they were together yeah. at Newcastle. Good so, yeah. Worker, though, good player. Good absolutely, player. yeah, absolutely. Thanks, guys. Ajoy, Roddick, Dean Garner, Grant, Thomas Asante and Garner Hickman. BTA and TGH on the bench. Come on, Baggies. Come on. So, yeah, as I was saying, guys, don't know if you could hear me there. Um, but, yeah. Uh, Andy Carroll starts. Um, yeah, Andy Carroll starts. Tom in starts, Junior Hoylet starts, all for Reading. They've got Shane Long on the bench, another former baggy. So yeah. Uh, on first as the only man to have won the World Cup three times, helping Brazil to lift the trophy in 1958, 1962 and 1970. He's also credited with scoring a world record, 1,281 goals and 1,363 career appearances. Ladies and gentlemen, as the whole sporting world mourns the loss of one of its icons, we invite you to celebrate his life and achievements with a minute's applause, which will end on the referee's whistle. Yeah, great tribute there from uh, for Pelé, one of the greatest footballers ever to exist. The greatest. The greatest. Yeah. So yeah, I mean. I mean, like you've got your Lionel Messi's, your Cristiano Ronaldo's. Yeah, your Maradonas and that. But yeah, none of them was your a Mark patch. Dallas. Yeah, none of them was a patch on Pelé. You know, we weren't around to see him play, obviously. Um, you know, we were born way too late for that, but yeah, you know, I mean, thoughts are with Pele's family from everyone here at Crazy Shadow Talks Football. Now we've just kicked off, guys, and you can hear the noise. You can hear the noise. Come on, baggies, let's get another win. Boing, boing. All right, guys, four minutes in, Yakuslu's at it again. Uh, long range effort. This time, didn't have the desired effect like it did against Preston the other day. Um, 
just uh, just wide from Yukuslu. Um, in terms of uh, the first three minutes, um, Reading, Reading have tried to make something of this. They're, they're in now. Oh, good defending from the Albion. Uh, and yeah, oh, oh, it's broke through. Oh, we defend, we defend well again. But yeah, Reading, Reading have been trying to make something of this. Reading have been trying to make something. Oh, go on, go on. Oh, oh, save. We nearly broke through then on the counter. Oh, I was gonna say. Oh, here we go again. Oh, it's a corner! It's a corner, guys! But yeah, it was um, basically Reading and Albion were feeling each other out like the first four minutes. And then, literally, the last minute, it's all come to life for the Albion. Quick counter attack, nearly scored, good save from their keeper. And now it's a corner. Uh, John Swift with the corner here. Come on, guys, come on. Oh, 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 hit the post! Hit the post! It hit the post! Come on, guys, this is good! This is good from the Albion. We've forced the save out of the Reading keeper, and we've hit the post. And we've hit the post as well. Yeah! Wow! Somehow it's still nil nil, guys. But yeah, Red, Reading tried to make something of it. We hit him on the counter. And then the momentum suddenly shifted to, to the Albion. Six minutes in, guys, and still, somehow, it's Albion nil, Reading nil. Somehow, guys. Wow. DK was nearly in again. Uh, another corner. Swift to take. Oh, my oh, God. No. Andy Cavill clears. Mm. Andy Cavill clears. Oh, oh we, tried to, we tried to get it. Oh, it's a red in throw. But yeah, DK was nearly in again. Another good save from the keeper. Forced to DK. DK tried to take the shot and the defender blocks it for a corner. Unfortunately, nothing came of that corner, but seven minutes in, guys. And it's still, again, we, it could have been 2 0, but instead it's. 2 0 in seven minutes. Yeah, but instead it's Albion 0, Ready 0. Keep out two good saves um, on behalf of Reading, to be honest. Eight minutes in, guys, we oh. get a corner. Oh, DK! Oh! Unlucky DK! Unlucky DK! Oh, no. It just it up. 14 minutes played. No. Yeah, 14 time minutes time. played. We had another corner. Swift. Oh. Oh. Why is this wet thinking? Uh, free kick to Reading. This is free kick go to Reading. This is going to go in. Yeah. But 14 minutes played, guys. We had another corner. Swift. You know, put it in the box. DK header. Uh, DK header, another save from their keeper. Uh, keeper's having a decent day today so far in the first 15 minutes. Um, yeah, but yeah, what, now Reading have a free Preston kick. This is what was doing on Thursday. Yeah, their keeper kept him in it. Uh, so yeah, uh, 14 minutes play, guys, nearly 15. And it's still Albion nil, Reading nil, but Reading have a free kick now. Come on, Albion. Nothing came of that free kick. If anything, we're on the attack. Come on, DK. Oh, I couldn't quite get there. Got tackled, but it's an Albion throw. It's an Albion throw. Fortunately, whatever whatever routine they were trying, they completely messed it up, Reading did. Fortunately for Albion. 15 minutes play, guys. Still, Albion nil, Reading nil. 20 minutes play, guys. We get another corner. Swift. Oh. Didn't quite pull it off didn't quite pull it off but we come again we retain the ball we come we, again we recycle it yeah we recycle it here we go here's Jed John Swift back to Furlong come on oh, oh nice oh. oh nice oh no one there to uh, oh. connect with the cross no one there to connect with the cross Furlong got, Furlong got hauled down. If they scored, Furlong got down. hauled down. Reading get away with one. Uh, 20 minutes play, guys. Still Albion nil, Reading nil. Come on, guys. 25 minutes play, guys. Nearly a chance for the Albion. Jed Wallace did well to keep possession. Uh, put the cross in. 
was aimed at Matty Phillips. That's a free kick to the Albion, definitely. Oh. Straight through to Jed Wallace again. Come on. Oh. Oh. Keeper claims. Keeper claims. That was too close. That was too close to the keeper. Keeper claimed it there. Uh, but yeah, as I was saying, guys, uh, Jed Wallace put the cross in. It was aimed at Matt Phillips, but their defender got enough of the ball to uh, lift it over Matt Phillips and out for an Albion throw. Um, oh. And we kept possession yeah. and had that chance as well, oh. which went to the keeper. Oh, oh go on, Jed. Go on, Jed. Oh, go on, Jed. Jed. Jed's back. Come on. Up to Furlong, trying to cross it. Trying to cross it. Oh. Keeper claims again. Right. Oh, keeper claims again. The keeper. Yeah, it's a little bit too close to the keeper at the moment, guys. Yeah. 27 minutes played, guys, still. Albion now, ready now. 29 oh, minutes played, guys. Uh, DK had a chance. Couldn't control the ball. Otherwise, he would have been one-on-one -on -one with the keeper. Um, you know, poor first touch and keeper collected. Oh, no. No. oh. oh good save, Palmer! Palmer with a save! Oh, no. oh no, let's go, no. let's go, let's go. Come on, come on! Counter-attack now for the Albion. Counter-attack for the Albion. Good save by Palmer there. Uh, but as I was saying, poor first touch from DK. Otherwise, he would have been one-on-one -on -one with uh, with the keeper. Matt Phillips uh, loses the ball. Phillips loses the ball. Uh, yeah, the uh, Reading keeper hoofs it. Only as far as Yakuslu. Freaking idiot. Uh, but yeah, half an hour played, guys. Still, Albion nil, Reading nil. Come on, baggies. Right, 37 minutes played, guys. Uh, we have another chance. I'm trying to get I'm through. Shooting. Trying to get through. Head trying out. to cross. DK! Oh, oh, just over. Just over from DK. Just over from DK. No, but here's the keeper. Again. Here's the keeper time wasting again. I 37 hate. minutes in, he's already time wasting. Fuck you can him. hear, you can hear the reaction Fuck of the Hawthorns crowd. Man. You can hear the reaction of the Hawthorns crowd. Why is it no but yeah, anything? I don't know. But yeah, 37 minutes Thank played. You, 37 minutes played, guys. Another chance for the Albion. DK uh, just over. Albion nil. Reading nil. 44 minutes played guys um, just about a minute of this half to go before stoppage um, yeah the game's kind of petered out at the moment yeah, a lot of um, a lot of misplaced passes a lot of uh, goalkeeper time wasting from the Reading keeper um, and yeah I mean the game has petered out a little bit uh, we did say it was going to be a tight cagey affair um, uh, but yeah, I mean, there's there's been a lot in the past ten minutes. There's been a lot of uh, misplaced passes from wasting. from Albion's uh, from Albion's perspective. Reading are now playing a little bit of possession ball. And you know what? Um, if they lose, but yeah, not them. yeah. So we're just um, just about to see what um, how much stoppage there is. Uh, one minute added on. One minute added really? on. How is it one yeah. minute? Especially with the keeper. Yeah. One minute added on with, with the time wasting. One minute added on with the time wasting. Yeah, go figure. Uh, still nil-nil, guys, and this is looking like a half-time score. All right, guys, half-time. West Bromwich Albion nil. Reading nil. Um, to be honest, Reading look like they've set up to uh, get the point. Uh, to be honest, they, they're playing for a draw, it looks like. Um, and yeah, they've been keeping their shape, they've been defending well. Their keepers made a few saves. We was unlucky to hit the post at one point. Um, and yeah, we've had the better of the chances, but they've just not been going in. Uh, Palmer's made a few decent saves, but nothing too much for him to do uh, this half. And yeah, you know, it's like we've had the better of the chances. Reading have set up to defend here. Uh, and yeah, their keeper especially has kept them in the game. And, you know, after about half an hour, it looked like we were running out of steam. Uh, so yeah, I mean, 
So yeah, I mean, half time, guys. We're still in this. We could still win. Uh, but then again, so could Reading. Reading could nick it as well. I hope that's not the case. Um, so yeah, at the moment, guys, half time score is Albion nil. Albion nil. Reading nil. Come on, Maggie. Second half coming up next. Right, second half just kicked off by the Albion. Still nil nil. Can we win this? Come on, Baggies. Boing, boing. Uh, just a minute and a half into the second half, guys. 46 and a half played. Uh, we get an attacking free kick and a Reading player has just been booked. Come on, guys. Come on. This is, this is a dangerous free kick. Uh, we just need this to go in. Come on. The referee's just sorting st some stuff out in the uh, in the box. Uh, yeah, referee's taking his sweet time though. So, yeah, come on, this is this is a chance. This is a chance. Come on, come on, stick this in. Come on. What is, what is the ref doing? What is the ref? This is this is very uh, yeah. Just waiting for the ref to get out of the way, guys. <laughs> Come on. That has taken all of thirty seconds for the ref to organise everything. Come on. Oh, it's hit the wall. It's hit the wall, and it's clear. Hit the wall, and it's clear. Still nil nil, guys. 53 minutes played, guys. Another chance for the Albion. Uh, went wide. There was a penalty shout just before the uh, shot was taken, but the referee said no. Um, so, yeah. Um, didn't see who took the shot. Careful, Palmer. Yeah. Man on. Here we go. We, we get it clear. We get it clear. Come on. Come on, Connor. Connor Townsend on the ball now. Oh, well done. Come on, yeah, but as a oh, oh, Redding got Redding's got oh. the ball back. Redding's got the ball back. Come on. Oh, oh, we get it, we get it. Redding can't keep hold of the ball at the moment. That's good for us. Uh, but yeah, there was a penalty claim from the Albion, um, but the referee said no. Didn't quite see who it was uh, who took the shot, but it went wide, so it was another chance. 54 minutes played. Oh, it's a corner. It's a corner. The referee, um, the referee indicates a corner. Keeper tried to grab it, but he messed that one up, and uh, it's behind for an Albion corner. Behind for an Albion corner. Not sure what the cheers are for at the moment from the Brummy Road end. Not sure what the cheers are for, for the, from the Brummy Road end. Something must have happened down there. Keeper's booked. Keeper's been booked? Yeah. Booked for time wasting. Yeah. Keeper has been booked for time wasting. Finally, it's only taken 55 minutes. Oh. We take the corner. Trying to cross it in. Oh, Neely. Go on. Where is it? Oh, oh. keeper claims. Keeper claims. 55 minutes play, guys. Still Albion nil, Reading nil. But the keeper has finally been booked. He can't time waste no more, thankfully. Sub for the Albion, guys. Matt Phillips comes off. Grady Dean Garner comes on. 56 minutes played. Still nil nil. But can Grady make the difference? Come on, Maggie. Sub for Reading. Julia Hoyler is coming off. Amadou Mbege uh, is coming on for Reading. So that's one. Uh... Yeah. Shine the lights on, 57 minutes play, guys. All right, 59 minutes play, guys. Yeah, you can hear it from the Hawthorns crowd, especially the smoke end. Um, yeah, thoughts on Gujan Lai again. Uh, shine a light uh, on the 57th minute as per um, there is a protest after the uh, after the game on the, outside the stadium on Halfords Lane so I'll try and get some footage of that uh, at the end of this vlog but yeah uh, in terms of what's going on on the pitch uh, 59 minutes played Albion are trying to work the ball into the box but it is still Albion nil ready nil Much of the goal! No, no. I didn't even 
Wow. So, yeah, the usual uh, DK for a Sante sub uh, has happened. Um, DK gets his goal, thankfully. It is, uh, yeah, Palmer gets that away. So, yeah, I know Reading were, it looked like Reading were playing for a point, but now they've got to chase the game. Uh, 65 played, guys. Thomas Asante on, DK off. Um, John Swift off as well. Uh, for Tom Roddick uh, so yeah 65 played guys and it's Albion 1 Reading nil. come on Baggies Reading sub uh, Guinness Walker off uh, Baba Raman is on well, he didn't um, do the Guinness Book of Records no <laughs> uh, meanwhile um, Albion's physios are on uh, hey! Andy Carroll comes off Andy Carroll comes off Andy Carroll comes off, who's come on? But uh, Lucas Shaw uh, has come oh, on no. for Andy Carroll. No. For Andy Carroll. It's a triple. It's a triple. <laughs> Shane Long comes on now. Shane Long comes on, former baggy. Should, should I boo him? Uh, well, he, he did well when he was playing for the Albion. Uh, so yeah, Yako Mete off, Shane Long comes oh, on. No. Uh, quite a few boos, quite a few claps. So, mixed messages there from the Hawthorns crowd. Um, but yeah, uh, yeah, it was Eric Peters that had to receive treatment though. Um, as I was saying, the uh, Albion physio was on for Eric Peters because he was down um, after trying to put a tackle in. Uh, seemingly hurt himself, but now he's back up and okay. 72 minutes play guys and it's still Albion 1 Reading 0 come on back 78 play guys Reading had a corner tried to make something of it but we defended well uh, Reading have tried to push for an equaliser it's got to be said Alex Palmer has commanded the box well um, we've been trying to get it up but we can't seem to retain possession at the moment uh, so yeah Reading are pushing us all the way and that's a Reading throw uh, yeah. I'd probably take a, I'd probably take yeah, Reading are pushing us at the moment. I'll take a draw. You know, we take a draw. Yeah, Davin says he'll take a draw. I'll take a draw or keep it as is, one nil. Um so yeah, it's seventy-nine played. Like so seventy-nine played guys, eleven to go plus stoppage. Oh come on! Oh we're breaking, we're breaking, we're breaking! Come on, shoot! Shoot! Oh I couldn't get the shot! Couldn't get the shot! Oh, just wide, just wide. He had the chance. Tried to take the shot, just wide, guys. 11 minutes played, 
uh, 11 minutes to go rather plus stoppage it's going to be a and it's still Albion yeah it's going to be a long 11 minutes plus stoppage and it is Albion 1 Reading 0 Reading starting to come back into this game now uh, 81 play guys so close to 2-0 so close to 2-0 didn't quite see who it was it was probably Thomas Asante um, but yeah oh my days that was close that was close wow wow so close to 2-0 there didn't quite pull it off and yeah uh, Reading sub Jeff Hendrick off and Femi Azez on um, so yeah come on guys that was so close to 2-0 but still somehow 82 minutes to play 82 minutes played rather Eight plus stoppage, and it's still somehow Albion one, Reading nil. Five to go, plus stoppage, guys. Reading get a corner. Trying to. Oh no! Oh. No. Reading couldn't get a shot off. Thankfully for us, Reading couldn't get the shot away. Thankfully for us. Come on, they're out the box. They're out the box. They're trying to work it back in. Come on, guys. Come on, defend. Defend it. It's crossed in. It's crossed in. Good header, but it's another corner. It's another corner. It's another corner, guys. Oh. Four minutes. Four minutes plus stoppage. Reading are really pushing now. It's another corner. Oh, oh, it's over. It's over. It's over. Thankfully for the Albion, it is over. They got that. Reading got ahead to it. I think it was Joe. But yeah, it was over, thankfully, for the Albion. 86 minutes play, guys. Four to go plus stoppage. Still 1 0. Come on, guys. Albion 1, Reading 0. Sub for the Albion. Eric Peters off. Semi Ajay comes on. Semi Ajay comes on. He's back. He's back, guys. Two and a half minutes to go. Jed Wallace off. Taylor Gardner Hickman comes on. Jed Wallace off. Taylor Gardner Hickman on. We have put basically like for like defender and midfielder, really. And yeah, I mean, 88 minutes played, two to go plus stoppage. Last roll of the dice now. You know, we need to defend this 1-0 lead because or Reading, or yeah, make or make it two because Reading have started to come back into this game massively. You know, they're desperate for an equaliser and to be honest, the draw will feel like a defeat for the Albion at the moment. But yeah, about a minute and a half to go plus stoppage. It is still Albion 1, Reading 0. Come on, Baggy, see this out. Five minutes added on, guys. We're in that now. Oh... Come on, the guys defend, defend, defend. Oh, Reading are pushing, Reading are pushing. We're trying to get in the way. Get in the way, guys. Oh. Claims of handball from the Albion players, but nothing doing. Oh, man. Well, I don't know where we got five minutes from, to be honest. But you can hear the crowd. You can hear the crowd. We're in the stoppage time now, guys. Still, Albion 1, Reading 0. Come on, guys, see this end. We're nearly there, guys. Another shot from Reading just goes wide. Palmer lets it go. He won't be in a rush to take this goal kick. He won't be in a rush to take this goal kick. Come on, guys. You can hear the noise in here. In the, at the Hawthorns, it is definite. Come on, guys. Come on, this has to be it. This has to be it now. Come on, man. I don't know how it was five minutes, mate. But we're nearly the end. We're near the end of that now. Come on, ref. Come on, ref. Blow that whistle. Palmer takes the uh, goal kick. Come on. Oh, no. Oh. Come on. Can we defend? Let's just 
We need to keep the ball, guys. We need to keep the ball. Yes! Well done, Townsend. Well done. Come on. Ready to take a quick throw. It's got to be time, ref. It's got to be time. Yes! One now to the baggies! One now, guys! One nil to the baggies! Double DK with the difference! Double DK with the difference! Yes! Yes! I think we're up to eighth, guys! Oh my god! Wow! That was an emotional roller coaster, guys! But we got there in the end! West Bromwich Albion won! Reading nil! Yeah! Thank God! Absolutely! Yes! West Bromwich Albion won! Ready now! We're up to eighth, I think, guys! Let's go, Baggies! See you outside! Yeah, Norwich lost to Watford! Wow! We will see you outside where I can get some footage of the protest going on at Alfred's Lane! But yeah! Thanks so much, guys. Full time, full time. West Bromwich Albion. Hey, Wigan next uh, at the end of the month. But yeah, West Bromwich Albion one. Ready nil, full time. Let's go, Baggies. Another three points. Stays here at the Hawthorns. Boy, boy. <laughs>
right guys so uh so there you have it um albion won reading nil full-time score and the protest is still going on behind me at the hawthorns outside the uh director's entrance uh as you could probably hear um so yeah um police have uh, i've spotted a few police officers now so i've come away uh, <laughs> you know because uh i don't want any of that um so yeah i mean gauchin where's our money where is the money that you took out of the club you were supposed to pay it back like a couple of days ago and you didn't so what the you know where where is the money so this protest is absolutely justified um obviously the 20 million loan as well you know each to their own with with that with uh, the opinion of the 20 mil um loan and yeah i mean that was the uh that was the protest uh for all that uh action for albion um yeah doing phenomenal work trying to raise awareness uh for you know what gochen light is doing to this club and yeah uh it won't stop until gochen light sells the club it has to be said thank you so much for watching guys uh the important thing is we do keep three points here at the hawthorns we're up to eighth i think in the table and yeah if you like this video guys then please 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 leave a like subscribe to crazy shadow talks football if you haven't already done so and don't forget to hit that bell icon to get notified on all new content on the channel thanks so much for watching guys west bromwich albion one ready nil boing boing another three points bye for now